Ahoy, mateys! Michael here, playing Nightmares from the Deep, a video game about pirates. For most of the 18th century, the Caribbean Sea was a deadly place to sail. Its waters were terrorized by the fearsome Captain Remington. Rumors spread from port to port about Remington's pact with the devil. During his nefarious career, he plundered many ships and murdered even more men. Until the day armed forces finally caught up to him. be the story about the villain of this game, Captain Remington, an evil pirate with a cursed heart. Now, 300 years later, Remington's body is being extracted from the depths of his watery grave. Soon, this precious artifact will be on display in the Caribbean Naval Museum. What museum? So in this game, we be playing as Sarah Black, who owns the museum. And I'm going to be skipping the tutorial. Sure thing, Miss Black. I'll leave the crate at the end of the exhibition hall. Great, so he's dropping off the dead body, and this is my daughter, Katie Black. Hi, Mom. I just want to sneak a quick peek at this legendary pirate, and then I'll stay out of your hair. Come on, let's check out the crate that just arrived. Yar, 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 that sounds like fun! Tis a good plan, Katie. There, you're all set. Now, if you don't mind, I'll be on my way. Thank ye kindly. The crate is nailed shut. Do you think we could pry the lid off? With so many tools lying around, I'm sure you can find a crowbar. I'll stay here and keep an eye on the crate. Oh right, I still have the key card to your office. Here you go. And don't worry, this mummified corpse won't be going anywhere without me. Alrighty, so that's our first objective. We need to open the crate with a crowbar. So let me see. The office is right over here. And inside the office, we can get a key to the basement. Ah, and check out this picture. Ah, that'd be lovely. Nice little cowboy hat. Ahoy, mighty! I'm here with my cowboy hat, I am. A yard. Wow, this video is filled with all sorts of strange accents. Uh, this is the basement, everybody. I'm, I'm gonna stop doing accents here. This is the basement. We have a crowbar. We have some artwork. Hmm, nice, nice little, nice little picture there. And this is where we have the electronic stuff. Okay, everything's in working order. Ooh, maintenance forgot to stock the fuses. Hopefully that won't come back to bite us in the butt. The most fearsome pirate in the world! Grand opening soon! Okay, so... We have the crowbar! Time to open the box with the dead body! This is the fearsome Captain Remington. What is this? Some sort of crystal in his mouth. Well, to complete the exhibit, we need to do these three things. We need to get his accessories so he can look fabulous. He needs his sword, his pistol, and his fancy, fancy thing. Something else from Professor Holmes? Hmm. Okay, so there's something in our office from Professor Holmes, but the other two things are here. 
So we need to get his special cut list. To do this, you want to click on the cut list, which is on top. That's how this puzzle works. Always remove the top cut list. And eventually, you get Captain Remington's cutlass. Very nice. Professor Holmes was wise to leave the accessorizing to you, Mom. You're great at putting an outfit together. Ah, thanks, Katie. Alright, here's another puzzle. Use the box opener to open the box. Whew. Oh man, that was a tricky puzzle. Can't believe I solved that one. Fantastic, so this is his pistol. And uh, let's accessorize. That's strange. That is very strange. The flashes of lightning are really playing a trick on my eyes. Yeah, yeah, that was just the lightning. He's not like an undead pirate ghost mummy thing, right? <laughs> huh? Uh, anyway, uh, Professor Holmes left me something inside the safe. Safe code is on my desk. Well, that's not a very safe place for the code. It's right here. And what's this? Captain Henry Remington was the terror of the Caribbean Sea during the early part of the 18th century. His infamy quickly spread after a series of attacks on merchant ships, but his reign ended just after a few years uh, when he mysteriously disappeared. His body was never found until today. Proving this fascinating myth true became the goal of many naval historians, and many expeditions were sent out in search of his earthly remains. On the music. Yeehaw! Well, that's a fancy cowboy picture. Oh, lovely daughters, them kids, they grow up so fast. Okay, so with this puzzle, what you want to do is you want to get everything down here. So, right four, so that means you turn it counterclockwise till you reach number four. Left, turn it counterclockwise until you reach number nine. Clockwise to number six. Counterclockwise to number one, and clockwise to number eight. So, the pirate artifact. So, it needs a gem, and I have a gem. Unbelievable. The jewel casing claimed the gem is its own. Okay, really, Sarah, you're not worried about the evil pirate at all yet, because I'm kind of freaked out. Oh, 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 oh. oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Uh, Katie, Katie, what's going on? Mom, you know I'm scared of the dark. Could you check the fuse box? Katie, you're a big girl. Why are you scared of the dark? Oh well, okay, so we have to go to the fuse box, but before we can do that, we need to get a flashlight. Right, we grab an axe and a flashlight. Flashlight is used down here where we have a hidden objects challenge. And this is an interesting challenge because we can either find the hidden objects or we could play Malyong. Now you'll notice here in Malyong we have uh, several tiles which are gold colored. They are special colored tiles. Those represent things that we need to find in the hidden objects challenge. So let me show you how that works. See, I matched these two. Something gets marked off of the hidden objects challenge. So that's how this works. You can go back and forth between Malyong and hidden objects. Or you could do only hidden objects or only Malyong in order to solve this puzzle. Now, 
what happens is if you find a hidden object like this, let's try that. And we find the tripod. It doesn't get rid of the Malyong pair, it just turns it into a normal tile rather than a special gold tile. Great, so now we have the three fuses, and the fuses go here in the fuse box. Let's get rid of the old fuses. Put the fuses in the right spots, and then turn on the switch. Yes! The power has been restored. Yeah, the power looks fine. Great! Everything's perfect. Ah! Mom! Come here, quickly! Katie! I thought you were watching this! Katie! What, what happened to the dead body, Katie? I can't believe my eyes. The, the showpiece just ran away. And he dropped something in the crate in the wood shavings. Dead pirates don't just run away, right? What's this in the shavings? It's a magic ring. A magic ring? You, you might have done this earlier, but um, if you open this, you'll notice this NEEDS a magic ring. This awesome artifact from Stan. Stan. Thank you, Stan. So this is a golden doubloon. Aha! Of course, golden doubloon. Was there someone behind me? Was it the evil pirate captain who was going to kill me and kidnap my daughter and not take her to the Texas Roundup Fair? Because Katie wanted to go to the rodeo this year! Katie? What are you doing up there, Katie? Mom! You'll serve my purpose, maiden. Sail forth to Skull Island. I do not like the looks of this. Okay, a ghost pirate ship? Really? A ghost pirate ship has attacked my museum? Now we'll never get to go to the rodeo.